Hello everybody, this is a review of the Victorian Knox Farmer, or if you would say in German, Bauen, which means farmer. And it's very uh, similar to the soldier, or what the Germans would call Soldaten, soldier version. And I'll go over some of the basic features of it. Now one thing you'll notice, compared with the regular uh, Swiss Army knife, is these blades are a little bit thicker. So we can get this puppy apart here. This is your saw. And it is sharp. It's also tapered in the middle. Slightly thinner. Supposedly this helps with binding. Uh, so when you're sawing. We get the blade out. When these things are new, you want to be careful not to hurt yourself. And as you can see, if you have a regular big, uh, Victorian knife, you'll see this is slightly thicker. Maybe about a millimeter or so thicker. And the helmsman here. Uh, that gives you an idea. Pretty well a standard 91. No, 93, I think, in millimeters, what these are. No, it might be 91. I'll have to measure it again. Anyways, it's one of those two. Because I know this is 111. Let me get another. I might have another one of my controllers come here. Yeah, I'll compare it. Alright. Here's the 84 millimeter. Here's your. Standard size, man. Let's take a look here. Yeah, so it'd be your, your standard lens. These are new. Uh, the spring tension is a little bit tighter on um, the the Alox or the aluminum body versions. Here's your. Uh, all no no hole in there, but it's in a good location, so it makes it nice to work with. Give you an idea. See how the camera is working. Problem is, uh, I've got a white uh, microfiber cloth here, so the silver is probably con not very contrasting with that. And here's our flat blade screwdriver. Yeah, you can feel that the tension on these is much tighter than on these. So the initial force to open it is greater. Can opener. What I'm going to do is we're going to open it up and compare. Let's get the all right. Let's compare the blades on these two guys here. Okay. Yeah. You you probably see the difference. Obviously this one's longer. The Alox or aluminum body is longer. It's a couple millimeters longer. See what my camera can performance is here, but let's move this so we can actually see it. You can probably see that this guy is definitely thicker. Because this is supposed to be more heavier duty than these. Of course, there is a drawback that there is no uh, uh, tweezer or toothpick slot. But you gain durability. It's always a trade off with everything. Well, that's it for this review. This is, these are very nice. Uh, th these came out, the Farmer came out in 1957, along with the uh, it's, uh, Pioneer, which is what the Soldier version was based off of. I'll give you a little history of these. So these have been around a long time. Uh, 
57, we're getting close to almost 60 years now. Uh, in a couple of years it'll be 60 that these have been out. So they're a great knife, great for durability. And of course you got your engraving plate there. And well worth buying and having because these last a long time. Alright, well that's it for the review of this Victorian Knox Farmer.